Hi, my name's Simon Allen and I'm going to take you through setting up a UCORS account to create a mount point like this one here in Howard, Tasmania and a client to access it. On the left here you will see I've got two tabs. One is my ReachView base which I've set up to use the Singapore server and you can see here my RS rover is receiving its differential grey bars here, corrections from that server creating a fixed solution. So in this left tab you can see the RS base is currently using LoRa to uh, transmit its corrections and my rover is using LoRa to um, to receive those corrections and it's connected to localhost that's a good thing if I go to status on the rover we can say although at the moment my um, my solution is afloat I'm receiving the grey bars which are the corrections from the base now here we are in UCORS I'm gonna create a new account There you go, I am now registered, which wasn't that painful. I'll now go create a mount point. Mount point, I want to add a mount point. The mount point, I'll choose my caster. I'm going to use UCOR Singapore because I'm down here in Australia. And I'm going to call it, let me see, how. Uh, test and I'll create a user and a password I now have a test point but I now have to give it some uh, information so my mount point will be in Howra and the RTCM output is 3.2 Format details will come through. Um, yes, I want to create L1 RTK, NAS system, GPS plus GLONASS, network. Well, in my case, I'm at um, GDA 94, 94 coordinates. I am in Australia, yeah, which is minus 42 decimal. 8834703910391 my longitude is 147.09094678 no i'm not requiring nmea it's a single base solution. The generator is uh, reach RS. That's just a free text field, so it doesn't have to be that. Uh, no compression encryption, basic authentication fee, no user fee, bitrate levers zero, miscellaneous demo. Yes, we'll say test station update. I now have a mount point. We will see that I need to put in the address of uh, the UCORS NTRIP server, which is sgucors.com. You can find the casters up here. If I click on here, I should be able to see the information I need for those casters. There you go, UCORS Singapore. That's my URL I'm entering, or I can do the IP address. There's my port number. So that's where the information is. What's the description? There you go, all the bits and bobs of information. Red test. Apply that correction. And now in here, I create a client. So NTRIP is now broadcasting through the Singapore Yorkors 
on port 2101 and its mount point is called Howard Test which is my mount point over here just to confirm that I have a mount point and there it is I should find in sessions that it actually has started and hasn't finished yet so now we go to create a client add a client there you go, I now have a client created which means on the rover I can now move from the correction input oops, so I go back to the status we can see I've now lost my corrections via uh, LoRa so I go to my correction input and I swap to ntrip and the address is as per the caster sg dot your cause dot com port was definitely 2101 my username will be my client username and the mount point is the name of the site that I created the format is RTCM I do not need ah, that's because I stick an extra Y in there an R in there connected to our test. That's good news. So if I now look at my status, I should see my corrections, which are now coming through the Singapore link, and the differential time is cycling around about up to about 1.5 to oh, 2 seconds. There we go.